Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, I am Jodi Janelle. Welcome, welcome. Don't be shy about joining the family. Stay a while, you just might like it here. Um, so today I thought I would do a quick protective hairstyle video. I'm going to be doing some box braids on my hair. I haven't done it in such a long time and I just wanted to give my hair some chill time. So this is the hair I'm gonna be working with today. I'm gonna to be using the Afro Natural Define Knotless hair from Main Concept in the shade 1B. And this hair is pre-divided, anti-tangling, antibacterial. It's also pre-stretched. And I love that on the back, it gives you step-by-step -step pointer tips of how to braid your hair. And it also tells you the thickness of how many strands that you use. So you kind of have an idea of how thick you want Want your braids to be able to just grab and go non-stop so you'll be able to finish your style so much faster so the first thing I want to do is just prep my hair and just work in sections so I'm starting on a freshly washed hair um, I am not the best braider platter parter whatever but a for effort i try um but in the back i'm not too concerned about my parting game i kind of wanted like a poetic justice type of box braid look so that's what i'm going for and before you do any protective hairstyle, you always want to make sure that you're prepping your hair. So today I'm going to be using my friend's whipped hair butter from Genuine Growth to moisturize my hair. And guys, I am in love with this product. Again, it has all natural ingredients and this butter, you can use it at couple different ways it's not heavy on my hair but it's definitely one of the most unique products i've ever used i just take a little bit of the butter warm it up into my hands and it turns into this rich melted oily goodness that my hair just soaks up it adds so much shine and moisture to my hair it helps with any frizziness it makes it so soft it's rich in vitamins biotins minerals that helps repair your damaged hair it helps decrease the onset of breaking or split ends i really love this product shout out to my girl masoni you did an amazing job on this hair butter guys i'm going to link her instagram page below definitely go check out her page show her some love and support Hi right, guys, so I'm going to be showing you the easiest technique to get some box braids, some cute knotless box braids, especially for my friends like me who lack in the grip game. I can't grip for my life and I don't like using the rubber band method. I don't like a lot of tension or elastic. In my hair so what I do um, after I part my hair I do a simple three strand plait down my hair just about an inch long and then I'm gonna leave the tail of my hair free just so my hair can blend better with the braiding hair and it doesn't peek through and then this plait that I'm doing helps create a foundation to crochet the braid here underneath without causing a lot of tension to my hair um, but when I do this, I don't make my plait super tight. I don't want any tension on my hair or my edges. And I don't want it to be tight when I'm crocheting the hair through. So I make a secure plait, but not super tight. So my edges are free. We don't snatch edges over here, guys. We're team free edges so they can flourish and live their best life. So to start the install, I'm going to be using my crochet hook. Always make sure the latch is open when you slide it through. And for the first piece, I'm going to be using three strands of the braid here. Um, and then just be gentle when you're sliding the crochet here through. You want to um, make sure the latch doesn't get caught in the braiding here. And then just slide it through. And then for the second piece, I'm only going to be using two strands. Because that piece, I'm going to be combining with my natural hair so I was trying to make the plait look as even as I could so in total I'm using five strands of braid hair per section 
So you can see how easily the braid here glides through my natural hair. There's no tension, no pull, no tug on my edges. Um, so that's another reason I love doing this crochet method. Um, so the two strand piece, the one going up and down, I'm going to be combining those two together. I'm going to tuck my natural here in between them. And then the two pieces at the side, I'm going to use that to do another simple three strand plait all the way down to the end. So that's all there is to it guys this is the easiest simplest way to braid your hair and like i mentioned i have zero grip game my plait is not the best but i definitely want to try to get better at that making my plaits a lot neater but this is a nice protective hairstyle to do every once in a while just to give your hair a break so i'm just going to take my time finish up the rest of my hair just repeat the same steps and like i mentioned each box section i use a total of five pieces three at the side two on the top to combine with my natural here and then i just keep doing the simple three strand plait all the way down Alright guys, so this is what the braids are looking like. In the back section, I did a total of about 11 braids. And like I mentioned, I'm not too fussy about my parts um, in the back because it's in the back. <laughs> I leave the front to the last so I can take my time with that, make sure it's as neat as possible. And it's just easier to see so um, for the front section I want to take my time part out my sections to make sure everything's even and then I'll do my braids And for the front, I'm going to be using my Lotta Body Tamey Edge Control just to help my braids look nice and neat at the front. Side note, I'm waiting for Lotta Body to sponsor me because I love their products. Anyways, I digress. Um, all the other steps are going to be the same. I'm just going to use my edge brush just to smooth everything down, work in the product. I do the same three strand braids just like I did in the back. And then I still keep the five pieces with the braid here just to have everything look nice and even and uniformed. So again, I just slide my crochet needle in. This piece I'm using has three strands. The second piece has two to combined with my natural here and then I'm just going to continue with the simple three strand plait all the way down.
Here's to the good days, here's to the sorrows. This is a mistake, I know about tomorrow. I don't wanna fight no more, cause I don't feel the need no more, no. Just wanna make it stop. Maybe it's something in the water, or maybe we just hit the end of the road. Right now it doesn't even matter. It's too late not to let it go, and that's why I wish you the best and say goodbye. We start to get dressed and then. Just the stars. We had a good run. Don't say we did. All right, guys, so this is what my hair is looking like. I think I did a total of about 17 box plaits or braids in my hair. So to finish off, I'm going to be using the Genuine Growth Scalp Therapy Oil. You guys know how I love this product. Just like the whipped hair butter, all natural ingredients. This product helps with growth. Um, it helps repair strength to your hair. It helps repair volume that you might have lost any shedding or if you have any bald spots or receding hairline this product helps with that too and whenever I do protective hairstyles like this my scalp gets really itchy so this hair oil helps to soothe and calm my scalp And for the ends of the braid here, I'm going to be using a few flexi rods just to add a little bit of curl to the end. And it also helps seal the hair so the plait doesn't unravel. Um, I just do that, dip it in some hot water for a few seconds just to help everything seal and the curls to set. And yeah, that's it for this hairstyle. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. Definitely let me know in the comment section below if you like this video, if you guys try these box braids. I would love to know let me know what technique you guys are using what kind of braid hair you're loving I always like hearing from you guys and everything I use in this video I'm going to link in the description box below don't forget to check out my friend Masoni's hair products you'll be in love just like me don't forget to like subscribe give this video a thumbs up let me know your suggestions of what you guys want to see from me next and i will see you in my next video bye yeah. here's to the good days here's to the sorrows if this is a mistake i know about tomorrow I don't wanna fight no more, cause I don't feel the need no more, no. Just wanna make it stop. Maybe it's something in the water, or maybe we just hit the end of the